Check this out, it's your boy Crazy Alcane, CAC TV. We're here at uh, Greenhouse, where they actually have like trees and stuff when you walk in, but the trees are plastic. They're plastic, but they said that they were using recycled tires. So I think, I don't know, it might be some kind of way it flips together and it makes it green. We got Sawrock representing. Come through, come through, come through. We got Sawrock representing right here. She drove, she came all the way up from the ATL representing. Killed it. Did two and a half songs before they shut him down. And she just killed it. Made like a crazy impact on the crowd. Had everybody going crazy. She had, she had, she tried to get the mosh pit popping. And it was just crazy. It was crazy in there. Y'all missed it. Y'all missed, y'all going to some weak shit right now because the good shit ended. Check it. Look, they got a little, they got a whole nother party about to start up in this joint. But check this out. Sawrock, what's good? How you? I'm good, I'm good. I'm happy to be in New York and happy to see my family, happy to have rocked even if it was a short set. So, but I feel good. Word, that's what's up, that's what's up. So tell us about the Greenhouse event and, and your involvement with that. Uh, so basically, uh, the green, Greenhouse or the Green Festival is basically, um, this is the after party for the Green Festival, which is a festival that, that promotes awareness to like sustainability and, and saving Mother Earth and, and natural living and all that stuff. So uh, Squala, who was another one of the performers tonight, he had seen me in Brooklyn and we linked up in Atlanta, you know, maybe two or three years ago. But anyway, he's been trying to get me up to New York and he finally got me up to New York um, for this event. So I'm really glad to have been able to, you know, vibe out with y'all. That's what's up. That's what's up. Now look, if, if y'all haven't seen Sarak live, I'm telling you the energy is bananas. She's chilling right now. She's good. But the energy is bananas when she's on stage. It's a whole other person on stage, I'm telling you. So, so tell me about your inspiration, you know what I'm saying, what got you started spitting and everything. Um, I don't know. I think it was just time. Like, you know how um, kind of things just kind of well up inside of you? I think that I, I had been wanting to express my opinion, my perspective um, quite some time and been looking for an outlet to do that. Mm -hmm. um, and it just so happened that I met up with the producer, Soul Messiah, who's also a DJ, and I decided to try it out right one day. On, yeah. Right Soul Messiah. Right here. Yeah. Oh! They shooting. Something happened. Something happened. I made you. Soul Messiah representing right here. Peace, peace, peace. Soul Messiah, Universal Zulu Nation, Rocksteady Crew, God Hop. Peace. I don't say much. That's what it is. That's what it is. So you got up with Soul Messiah. You started. You started crafting your words and stuff. Who were you um, looking at as far as when you started crafting and stuff? I, I really wasn't looking at anybody. I don't. I don't believe in in like necessarily. Patterning, pattering, pattering, pattering. How do you say that? <laughs> Myself or after anybody, because I feel like if you if you listen to somebody too hard, quite possibly you can start to mimic them. Right, or right. and I wanted to just be my own MC, my own, you know, my own person. Mm -hmm. And you know, I have people that I like. I have artists that I love, Outkast, KRS One, Lauren Hill, all of that. But when I'm creating music, I don't really want to listen to anything else because I want it to be purely Syrah. So that's what's up. And and some of the artists right now that are, that are doing their thing, um, tell us about some of the artists that you're feeling that you know that somebody might not really know. You know what I mean? Um, uh, there's a lot of dope. I mean, I I don't want to you know harp on the whole female MC thing, but these sisters are actually dope MCs. You know, gender aside. Um, Book Brown, she's crazy though. I'm gonna shout out everybody from Atlanta, which is where I live now. Star, um, she's coming out with a new album uh, shortly. Um, Nerubi Salah, I just um, actually linked up with that sister. We just did a song together, the Space Benders joint. Um, uh, who else? Chop out of uh, Tallahassee or Jacksonville, but Florida, one of those. Jacksonville and uh, Ty Phoenix. You know, these sisters are like really, really ripping the game to shreds. And I really want, um, you know, the light to be shown on them because it's not just about, again, female MCs. It's about, you know, women who are dope and have like a dope perspective as well. It's positivity and it's also dope music. Um, Here on CAC TV, we definitely represent for dope MCs. As far as MCs you're not feeling, because there's got to be some MCs you're not feeling. Tell, tell me some of the MCs you're not feeling. Um, I know, right? Yeah, just, just anybody who's whack. Just anybody who's whack. Anybody who's lacking of integrity. You know, anybody who um, anybody who follows me, you know, know that I wrote an article called Why I'm Mad at Nicki Minaj for various reasons. So oh, You wrote an article about why you're mad at Nicki Minaj? Yeah, that's on SideRockTheMC.com, but, you know. Check that out. Check that out, son. Yes, please. Uh, Nicki Minaj is one of them, which who, you know, I think that she has talent. I think that she can rap, but she, you know, 
honestly has has decided to forego content in in, in lyrical um, lyrical uh, skill for money and pop and cheesiness. So yeah, so what, 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 what was the one thing Nicki Minaj did that really just made you go, damn? Um, I don't know. I can't pinpoint one thing, but maybe it was the dildo on stage. I think that was it when I knew that she has so many young women who are fans of her children, who are fans of hers, and she knows that. She's and she well caters to them. That. She caters to that. She's harping on the whole Barbie thing, and we know little girls deal with the whole Barbie thing, and they, they, they pattern themselves after Barbie. And for her to do that was just very irresponsible. It was gross. It was in poor taste, and it was just tacky. So tell us about... Just your um your albums that you have out, what you got coming, you know what I'm saying, it's future performances and all that. Okay, um, I have quite a few albums out. I have a Supernova, which was my first um, full length release, Journey of the Star Seed, which came next. Um, and right now I'm I'm touring with Eat the Wars album, which is the latest one. But I have like several mixtapes. I have um, Stardust. I have Book of Life. I have um, a mixtape. Um, well, not a mixtape. It's like a, a EP kind of Astral Chronicles. So several different things. Just check me. Check me on YouTube um, under Cyrock MC or Soul Messiah's channel or the website CyrockTheMC.com. And um, you know, as far as shows, uh, the I have a show coming up in Atlanta for the Malcolm X Festival in May. Um, and then the next one after that is a show in LA on July 8th. Um, so that's gonna be dope with I Wayne. All right, so real quick, hip hop trivia, real quick, come on, come on, come on, real quick, real quick, real I'll quick, real quick, real quick, <laughs> easy stuff. This is easy stuff. Okay. What does DJ stand for? Oh, uh, what? This jockey. What does MC stand for? Mac microphone. <laughs> well, you know what? Everything. Microphone, microphone control. control. Yeah. What does BDP stand for? Uh, ah, look at that, look at that. You can't help her. You can't help her. <laughs> There'll be no Zulu help. <laughs> no Zulu. When it comes to these kind of questions, oh, yeah, okay. Okay. what I ask you, Karis won the BDP. You said BDP. What does BDP stand for? Well, you know, I forgot oh, you. Right, right, right. <laughs> what does Karis one stand for? Knowledge rate supreme over nearly everybody. Name one member of Black Moon. <laughs> Five footer, is he in the group? <laughs> <laughs> name, one, name one member of uh, Tribe Called Quest. Q-Tip. Name another member. Jerobi. Jerobi. All right, there, all right yeah, there you go, there you go, there you go. Nice, nice. Finish the phrase, you ready? No, no, no. Come on, these, these, these are easy phrases, easy phrases. Ready? Engine, engine, number nine. I want that new drug, transit line. If my train falls off the track, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up! <laughs> a dee dee da dee 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 day. All you sucker MCs. I don't know. Go ahead. Come out and play. Something that they come out, yeah. Wow. It's disrespectful. That's disrespectful. I was busy dancing, kid. I was busy dancing back in the day. He's busy dancing. MF Doom. Used to be part of what group? MF Doom used to be part of what group? M D. All right, he gonna have he gonna have to stop. He gonna have to stop. No. He's my partner in rhyme. He he helps me with stuff like this. All right, he's your counselor. He's he's your hip hop counselor. Yes. For real though, I mean, like seriously, this has all been like a lesson. Me learning about hip hop through through rhyming. You know what I'm saying? I've only been doing this for three years, and you know, I'm learning. I'm I'm I'm, I'm studying, watching Star Wars and Wild Style and all these things. Uh -oh, uh -oh, uh -oh. So you know, you're doing the knowledge. You know what I'm saying? Doing the knowledge. Okay. You gotta say, you gotta understand. I'm what I'm 32 years doing hip hop, living it. She three. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You, know. you gotta, you, you gotta recognize God is in her. You know no what doubt, I mean? No doubt. No Male, doubt. female, whatever. Hip hop also. You know what I'm saying? It's God hop for real. Come on, come on, come on. What you got? What you got? What, what I got for you? <laughs> Finish this phrase. You ready? Finish the phrase. You ready? You ready? Ooh. What? <laughs> Ooh. Ladies there first. You go, there you go. There you go. Child. <laughs> that could have worked too. That could have worked too. Come on, I said a softball. A softball? Okay, a softball. A softball, okay. Softball. Let me think. Softball. Softball. Can I kick it? Yes, you can. Alright, alright. That's a softball. Name one member of De La Soul. Oh, um, ah, why can't I plug one? Okay, okay, because they got a bunch of names. You can, you can pick any one of them. Yeah. <laughs> Lauren Hill was part of what group? The 
Full jeans. <laughs> softball. That's a softball. All right, so check it out. It's crazy out came, man. It's raining. We're getting soaked out here. We're about to do spitting in the whip. So you're going to see Cyrock again. Peace, peace. My name is Cyrock. My latest prop. Blah. Do over. Do over. Rewind. <laughs> Peace, peace. My name is Sarak, the astronomical MC. My latest project is called Eat the Wars. And when I'm not in meditation, I am watching CAC TV. That's what it is. Say back to you, Billy. Back to you, Billy.